Note: The following video depicts a specific configuration of the notebook. The same removal and replacement procedures apply to all configurations of the notebook. Before you begin, remove the top cover and wireless WAN module if installed. Removal. Important: Ensure the battery cable is disconnected from its connector on the system board. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the audio board ZIF connector and disconnect the audio board ribbing cable from the audio board. Caution: Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbing cable. Remove the 3 mm P1 Phillips head screw that secures the audio board to the base enclosure. Grasp the right edge of the audio board and lift the audio board off of its alignment pins on the base enclosure. At an angle, slide the external connectors out of the cutouts in the base enclosure and remove the audio board. Place the audio board in a static dissipative bag. Replacement Remove the audio board from the static dissipative bag. Tow the external connectors on the audio board into the cutouts in the base enclosure and lower the audio board onto its alignment pins. Replace the 3 mm P1 Phillips head screw that secures the audio board to the base enclosure. Insert the audio board ribbing cable into the audio board ZIF connector on the system board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbing cable.